Hello everyone for more updates subscribe turn on bell icon if you have an iPhone that's older than 2 years, chances are it is not running as fast as it used to, not too long ago Apple was forced to confirm what has been suspected for a long time by some iPhones users, that it slows down older iPhones. But the company said it only does that for the good reasons, to prevent unexpected shutdowns caused by cold weather and aging batteries. Replacing an iPhone battery is the most efficient way to speed it up and give it a fresh start. But, did you know you can speed up your slow iPhone without replacing its battery by simply following some tips? Here are 8 ways to speed up your slow and old iPhone. How to speed up iPhone. Step 1. Clear up the RAM Your running apps consume a lot of RAM in the background, if you have multiple apps running at the same time, it may cause your iPhone running slower than usual. Sometimes closing running apps doesn't always free up those RAM, and it's not recommended either. To ensure the RAM were properly freed up, 1. Hold down the sleep-wake button 2. When you see slide to power off, release the sleep-wake button 3. Hold down the home button until the home screen comes back on you have cleared up the RAM, your iPhone should feel and run faster. If you've recently cleared up the RAM, you may summon Siri when holding down the home button. This trick doesn't apply to the iPhone X since it lacks the home button. Step 2. Free up some space Less space could be to blame if your iPhone is running slow. Time to free up some space. Go ahead and delete all the apps you're not using and back up your pictures to a cloud storage. To delete the apps go to your iPhone settings greater than general greater than iPhone storage. You'll see a list of all the apps install it in your iPhone with the amount of space used, delete the ones you don't need. Step 3. Reduce motion, increase contrast I know the parallax effect of the icons looks pretty cool, but those effects could potentially slow down your iPhone. Why overworking your iPhone when it's already struggling? Let's turn those effects off by going to settings, general, accessibility and toggle on reduce motion. Your iPhone has another awesome feature, which is transparency. It allows you to see a bit of your icons in the background when you open a UI element like the control center, but require more processing power. Go ahead and reduce those transparency effects by going to settings, general, accessibility greater than and toggle on reduce transparency. You should see improvements in your iPhone speed after performing these two actions. Step 4. Automatic updates It's convenient, but might actually not do good to your slow iPhone. Automatic updates use more memory and could lead to a slow performance of your iPhone. To prevent the apps from updating themselves, go to settings greater than iTunes and app stores and toggle off updates. You'll have to update your apps manually in the App Store app. Step 5. Clear your browsing history Unlike Android phones, you cannot clear apps cache. You'll have to completely delete the app and reinstall it. However, you can clear your browsing history, since it can take lots amount of your iPhone space over time. Go to Settings, Safari then tap on Clear History and Website Data. By doing this, you're removing all the information Safari has stored about the sites you visited. Step 6. Update apps Your iPhone may run slower if your apps are not updated. Do your poor slow iPhone a favor update all its apps. To do so, go to the App Store app, then tap on Updates and update all the apps that need to be updated. Step 7. Turn off Background App Refresh Background App Refresh could seriously slow down your iPhone, disable it could improve significantly your iPhone speed. To turn it off, go to Settings, General, Background App Refresh. You can either turn it off completely or leave it on and turn it off for specific apps. Step 8. Restore iPhone last but not least, if your iPhone is slow all the time, and none of these above tips seems to work, restoring it could make it run faster. Make sure to restore your iPhone as new, by doing so you'd remove any unwanted data, junk files, and caches that may have slowed down its speed thanks for watching.